Another TPing in here. This is very dangerous to try and defend. Look at the positioning right now, Tundra. As soon as Snapfire's in range, Kisses are going to party. Phantasm on the backside. Moves in to drive back on the Sacred. Stun is going to come out. Matthew trying to save the day by getting rid of the Tombstone. Sacred able to walk off out of the Sunstrike. Matthew in a bit deep, though, so Marcy should go down. Panda Moo as well. And you got to hesitate to defend this. I mean, Thunder, they're coming in with Dark Mago, but I'm not sure what you can do other than die here. Mistakes have been made. Primal War was committed, and now they might end up losing Sacred as well. He tries to save a hero. Save a hero syndrome will be his downfall. And just like that, a tier two push turns into a tier three. Well, to, you mentioned it from before the game even started. The targets, how Skidder has moved south side. So they might not connect with the prime targets. So they'll have to settle for 33 instead. They will hop straight on top, and Primal War's going to come out. Looks like the team's going to commit to a fight, dodge it out on the Starbreaker. They're in pretty deep. Funda need to think about retreating here. Reinforcements for Funda. Funda rather are arriving. They are going to commit the Solar Guardian, going deeper. Offered up an opportunity, 33 gets taken out. Saxer is down at Two that point. Factor protection initially, but eventually wears off. Now this is an Invoker, so not the easiest to continue to push into, but he's already thrown out his tornado, just going to ice fall behind if they want to dive. This is probably tier three. Yeah, he, he'd probably want to get a little bit closer if he could off the Dice Ball, because if you can slow one or two of these heroes, the Kisses can come out, but unable to get the opportunity. Snaking is now going to be forced to commit it, just to get them away before the tier three tower goes down. Heavy damage being done. The chop on the Gyrocopter, and Cold Snap as well. That's oh. going to be the Aegis gone right outside the base. This is a Power. dangerous position for Funda. That's BKB. He's going to be able to move away. Tombstone won't frame enough, but he did have to use the BKB, and now this is where Tundra will hop out and look for a kill. Goes in. Tornado, the ice wall put down. Matthew, he's going to feel that slope. Nice four step away to his teammate, though. Jower Copter in better positioning, but not good enough. He's forced to fight the Black Cannon. It's not going to be good enough. Hit the move with the freezing field, though. It's some good damage, but he will eventually fall as well. It's so, out. Oh, back to the feeling it. Yeah, Jower Copter. Cause might be in trouble. No. Trying to get range. He loses vision. He was about to scream, but he couldn't quite keep his eyes on it. Sax, and look how far he's going. They drag him out. No. Primal Roar now comes out of Dark Mango. So the Guardian can't save him. The buyback feels like a waste unless Picard can clean up. That One down, but plenty to go. Saxa stands his ground with the Tombstone there, but will be cleaned up in the end. But Tundra will take that fight every day of the week. They will. Now, we do see the presence of Gyrocopt right there when he's able to enable himself with the call down and the flat cannon use. Like, he was dishing out crazy damage. So Handing over his heritage, right? The, the, the lead to his Gyrocopt to take control of the game, which is why you see them essentially switch spots in the network. But now they're going to Gyrocopt. The Primal Roar comes out. He's gone. Thunder's hopes are now being crushed. Sacred is going to be found aside. That will be a dieback. No way he's getting out of this one. Gone for 70 seconds. Gyrocopter dead for 40. Pouncing at nighttime frequently on purpose. They smoke, they get just in range. Primal Roar comes out. And even if you're the quickest fingers in the world, if you're the quickest drawer in the West, you are probably still going to be gunned down by Tundra. Oh, five player smoke. Tundra looking for another jump. And they found one. They find the Marcy. The prime target, but they'll pick Gyro. Rush. They hexed back, him. But they got the Gyro. Yep, yeah, the hot to the side. There's the Primal Roar. Dom Breaker coming in, trying to save the day. BKB gets it off just in time. And now it's a turpentine to pop the Satanic. Alchemist jumps in as well. Skinner trying to hold his ground the best that he can. He's going to take out one, but now he's in trouble. They do kill Beastmaster. The Thunder Awaken, and Pakaz is doing some damage as expected. And there's the kill on Skinner over here. The Sheep up on Alchemist, but he's already he done nine. his job. In fact, Snake King's dead as well, and they are going to catch Nine once again. And Nine will fall. They only lose the Dom Breaker. In the big picture beyond the Marcy buyback, triple kill for the Alchemist. The, the interesting difference is it goes back to the idea that it's all about enabling Gyro. Usually Marcy's about how do I stop a carry, but not this time around. Speaking of carry, though, Dawnbreaker has been found out. Once again, after have to retreat, and Skidder needs to be careful because this time he doesn't have magic immunity. Meatball's being dropped onto the salad, but I don't know if Skidder can turn this. Stun's going to come out, tries to go for the kill on the CM, but he gives his life over. In the end, three are dead on the side of Thunder, though. Invoco just picking and poking at the side here. It allows him to take the lead. Oh, missed. Going in the concoction, though. Going to be lifted up by the tornado. Comes back down. The ice wall put down. Dowercopter's in trouble. Crystal Maiden buys back, trying to get here to help save his teammate. Dowercopter, flat cannons. He's got Satanic in 10 seconds. If he can hold this out, Tundra wants to kill it, but it's such a difficult ask when they've already used so much. Initially, Soxo's going to get beat down, and the rest will retreat. So, uh, this is what... Oh, no. right, sure. 
if he's activated, Negus is going to be picked up. Kisses has been used. Primal Roar will just allow them to retreat. Saxon drops the tombstone on the high ground to ensure that. They're hesitant though. They feel like they need to get some for good reason. They're going to hop in now. Skidder does get to stun out the Gyrocopter. There's going to be a save coming out from the Solar Guardian. On the backside though, CM has been found out by nine. Small kill, they need bigger ones. Saxa is going to go down. That's the dieback. Dead for 100 seconds. Snaking now being forced to try and commit, but there's nothing left for them to commit on here. Or out. Like, it's just getting harder and harder to kill him. You can see they're just going to try and poke and prod him, but so confident for good reason. Skid's going for the backstab on a Marcy. So the Guardian saved the day. Not good enough for the Marcy, but maybe the Gyro is going to be disarmed on the spot. <laughs> is alive for the time being. And now the counter attack's going to come in. Mago hops on to Beastmaster. Forced up to try and get him out. There's going to be an Ice Wall drop, which will slow down Pakaz, but Snaking is stuck a little bit too close to the sun. Just gets burned. That Ice Wall's annoying. It's, it, it actually prevents the death on the Snapfire happening. But so. Hunter just has to play so perfectly and do so much in these fights to truly win it. Where, I mean, Thunder Awaken, they, they certainly have to have their own effort with the supports and everything, but it, it feels like a much easier game to win now for Thunder Awaken. Guys, this is hot. The fight. So the guy is going to come out. Skid is going to be pursued. Forced to use the BKB, even on the football stuff. Nice disarm to push back, but snaking is done in this realm. One. It's, it's the same thing. Tundra goes in, they initiate, the Dawnbreaker Solar Guardian comes out, they retreat, and you know, they just hope to all survive. So it's the rinse and repeat, but the repeat's not necessarily working for Tundra in terms of uh, gaining some ground. In fact, they're losing a lot of it. And they're going to buy back on Snapfire. There is no Solar Guardian two. currently, but the engage is a big concoction. Set on two, the blow up on a Volker. He buys back immediately. Got to be careful not to go too far if you're the Alphabet. Focus on the tier fours. That's what Pataz wants to do. From a war, it's still on cooldown for 30 more seconds, by the way. So he's going to catch up the, the, the meatballs, but no, he gets saved from the Siemens. They're going all in on him, but he's getting pushed away. Pops the Satanic and turning right back in. So once again, Tundra has to shoot these ice balls. They're doing some work. It's not enough, though. He's got Divine Rapier. This Gyrocopter has to be addressed directly right now. Twice over at that. Stun's going to come out. Control him seems good, but the Solar Guardian save. All that evasion. There's no way through it. This is done. Funda are easily going to take out the throne before he can be taken out twice. Gyrocopter down at half HP. They're attempting it. Hex is at least going to sail for the moment. First life is gone. It's only him and Marcy versus the world. The double tombstone, maybe they have a way of recovering this. Primal Roar comes out. BKB was used by Picaz. He still has the cheese to work with. And Skidder yeah, is mechanic. already dead. It's Gyrocopter <laughs> versus the world. And he has dominion overall. Thunder Predator. Thunder Awaken rather become the Predators here and take game one. <laughs> what a way to finish this one. Beastmaster just going in says, you know what? You deserve it. The Godlike Ultra Kill. For a second there, I thought KP, I'm like, wait, is Tundra actually going to potentially stall this at least and give themselves hope? I mean, they picked off everyone around him. It's at that point, Thunder Awaken clearly was just going full YOLO, trying to actually finish the game, which is understandable. And that almost, it almost felt like that, that kind of backfired, but it didn't.